So my understanding that most of you understand uh, machine learning and data mining like this. You give it data, and then hopefully you get a program that will do what you want. <laughs> um, so we want to remove the black box and just go through this process of what we're doing. So first, you got to transform the data. So that is, you know, you take the data and you put it into some mathematical uh, object, and that will give you um, a partition between test data and training data. So you take this training data and you use it to find the relationships, to find the clusters. And then while you're doing that, you also tune it, you try to improve on your methods, and that gives you model data that tells you how many clusters there are, what are the ratios of words, and then you use the training data and the model data to build a learning model. And then that test data that you had taken out, you use that to test the model so that you don't you know, over-train or overfit your model, where basically your model's memorizing all the data that you've fed it. And then you get results, and you measure the results. If your results pass, then you have a, a model. It may not be the best model, but it's a model that works to some degree. And if you fail, or even if you do succeed, you want to go back, modify your methods, modify your data, and look to see is how can we improve on these. So the first thing we do is transform the data. We're going to look at a vector space uh, model. So basically, a vector is a mathematical object that has direction and length. So you 